Believe it or not, anyone who's been sexually active at some point in their life could have been infected with the human papillomavirus. HPV is a sexually transmitted disease that can cause serious health conditions, including cancers of the vagina, the penis, and if you've been having oral sex, even throat cancers and many others. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal the best natural treatment to help your body eliminate HPV naturally and effectively. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor, I treat my patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to receive notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need to line an appointment of quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLandivar.com. And I encourage you to stay till the end of this video, where I'm going to reveal extra tips and video links related to this topic. The human papillomavirus is a sexually transmitted disease that can be transmitted through vaginal, oral, or anal sex. And believe it or not, anyone who's been sexually active at some point in their life could have been infected with HPV. Once infected, it's possible that that person can naturally destroy this virus if the immune system is strong enough to combat this health condition. But other times, if the body is unable to control it, the human papillomavirus can induce the formation of certain general cancers, like vaginal cancers, cancers of the penis, anus, and even throat cancer. And this is why it's extremely important for anyone that's been infected, or even someone that has not yet been infected, to keep their strong immune system working at all times. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal the best natural treatment to help the body eliminate HPV naturally and effectively. Number one, keep your immune system strong. Keeping the immune system strong is probably one of the most important things you can do to stay healthy. I don't know if you knew this, but till this date, science or medicine have not been able to find a way to eliminate any type of virus. In the past hundred years, medicine has found ways to destroy bacteria, parasites, but sadly enough, not viruses. And this is the main reason why the best way to combat a viral infection like HPV is by keeping your immune system strong and healthy. I have an entire video on this subject if you wanna check it out right after this video. But to make things shorter and easier for you, let's summarize the best immune boosters available in nature. Some of the best foods and foods that you can find anywhere, by the way, that play an extremely important role in immune function are foods that are high in vitamin C content, including lemons, oranges, citrus fruits, kiwi, etc. Root vegetables that include garlic, ginger, and many others. Mushrooms like shiitake, myotake, and reishi. And important herbs that are great immune boosters like green tea, cat's claw, and graviola. I know that sometimes it's difficult to go out there and try to find all these components separately by themselves. This is why it's always best to look for good quality formula that contains all these ingredients to boost that immune function and have it working perfectly. At DrLandivar.com you can find I'm Defense from Finland, a 100% natural quality formula that contains more than 25 natural ingredients specifically designed to boost that immune function and combat diseases that threaten your health. Number two, have sex with a monogamous partner. If you're sexually active, you have a good chance of being infected with HPV. And this is the main reason why abstaining from sex altogether is the only way to avoid getting infected. Now, since we know that for the majority of people this is not easy to practice, Limiting the number of sexual partners reduces the risk of an HPV infection. And this is the main reason why having a monogamous partner is one of the most effective ways of preventing and even treating an infection by HPV. You see, there are more than 100 types of papillomaviruses out there, and it's very important to maintain your risk at a minimum. The more you get infected, the greater chances are of developing other health conditions on top of that like warts or even cancers. So a good piece of advice and one that's very important is to keep your sexual relationship with a monogamous partner. Number three, change your diet. Diet is extremely important and you have no idea how much this helps in an HPV infection. Let me put this into perspective. If you have any health condition, any at all, and the body needs to fight off an infection, it will need all the vitamins, minerals, amino acids, etc. to function properly. This means you have to start consuming foods that are going to help your body fight off the papillomavirus. 
Some of these can be organic fruits, that include citrus fruits, green apples, acerola, pomegranates, healthy vegetables like garlic, carrots, ginger, kale, lettuce, and bell peppers, organic brown rice, potatoes, etc. This is very important to keep in mind that the healthier the food you are eating, the healthier you will be. Never forget the fact that if the body does not have the elements to fight off a virus infection, there's a very small chance of resolving your problem naturally. And if it's very hard for you to eat healthy every single day, I suggest you find a good multivitamin formula that has real fruit extracts and vegetable extracts, something like multivitamin from Finland. This formula contains 42 different extracts from real organic fruit and vegetables, and on top of that, all the vitamins and minerals the body needs to stay healthy. You can find multivitamin at drlandivar.com. Number four, stay away from inflammatory substances. You have to always remember that inflammatory foods are one of the primary enemies when it comes to fighting off diseases or the papillomavirus. If you're eating inflammatory foods, these won't let your immune system function properly and end up interfering with disease control. So stay away from processed foods that are full of colorings, preservatives, chemicals, and oils that are toxic to your body. The only thing they do is toxify your organism and give you a hard time and not let your immune system work properly. Stay away from packaged goods, breads, pre-baked foods, or even fast foods. By the way, the consumption of hydrogenated oils like corn, canola, soil, or even sunflower oils dramatically increases the risk of heart disease by 25% or more. Very dangerous if you ask me. So instead of using hydrogenated oils, use flaxseed, olive, or even coconut oil. Number five, start consuming turmeric. The human papillomavirus is known around the world because it produces warts and cancers in genital areas. The good news is that one of the most well-known health benefits of turmeric is that it has a powerful capability of reducing inflammation and preventing the appearance of cancer. Turmeric is one of the healthiest herbs you can use. This herb reduces inflammation, joint pain, and can even help treat and prevent the appearance of certain cancers. A number of lab studies on cancer cells have shown that curcumin, which is the active component of turmeric, does indeed have anti-cancer effects. So if you can, try to find yourself a good source of turmeric or a curcumin extract, something like Curcu Health from Fineland. I strongly suggest you supplement on an anti-inflammatory substance like curcumin. At drlandivar.com, you're gonna be able to find Curcu Health from Fineland. The supplement contains a 95% curcuminoid extract with bioperin, two very powerful substances that enhance the absorption and protect the body against inflammation that can worsen in a papillomavirus infection. Number six, how to recognize if HPV is getting worse. Most people that get infected with HPV don't really develop any obvious symptoms, usually because they have a good immune function that can fight off the infection. But if things get worse and the human papillomavirus starts to spread and form other health conditions, you might develop symptoms that include genital warts, usually white or raised cauliflower-like warts that can be uncomfortable or even cause pain. Common warts that are rough bumps that usually are found in your hands, fingers, and your elbows. And plantar warts, which are hard, grainy warts that appear on the soles of your feet. Now, if things get even worse, there's a specific high-risk subtype called HPV-16, which can cause oral cancers or cancers of your genital areas. So if you see any late signs or trouble swallowing, coughing up blood or lumps in your neck, cheeks, or even ongoing hoarseness, I strongly suggest you visit a doctor to identify the cause immediately. Help out the channel by giving this video a thumbs up and sharing it with your friends and family. And if you have any questions, leave your comments down below and I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or align an appointment, visit drlandivar.com. And check out these other videos related to this topic. You're gonna find valuable information that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you soon.